So most of my clients are not in the present, are not, uh, yeah, are not in the present. They're in the past or in the future. They are numb, uh, fortunately. This is pretty much how their perception or their possibilities look like when they come to me, right? So my biggest challenge is not an aggressive dog, it's not an anxious dog, it's not a fearful dog, it's not an excited dog, whatever. My biggest challenge is to help the human to remove themselves for, for what they don't have control of. You have no control of the past, you have no control of the future. You have, that's reality. If you think about it, you have no control of either or. But what you have control of, can you please, is this. And this is the hardest thing for my clients to embrace. And this can be embraced by understanding how you feel. And it's nothing wrong feeling insecure. There's nothing wrong feeling angry. What is not going to be healthy to the relationship is that we are not aware of or we choose not to become aware of because our dogs will never move forward to a harmonious state or a balanced state because animals don't follow instability. So they will never feel secure. They will never feel that they can get direction from a human. And that's, all, that's what the human represents, you know, when a human is in a calm sort of state. Protection and direction. But when the human is in the past or in the future, is that human is in a fearful state, anxious state, excited state, unconscious state, future, they're anticipating something wrong. Right, so 